From Lindenwald High School, this is the Morning Roar with anchors Quentin Dute and Yashua Aqua. Meteorologist Carlos Coleman and the 411 with Carlos Coleman. Good morning, Gatley Test. I'm Quentin Dutan. Welcome to today's broadcast on the Morning Roar. Now, I'm Yashua, and today is Monday, January 27th. We will be having a Valentine's Day dance for all grade levels Friday, February 14th from 7 to 10 p.m. Tickets will be on sale in the cafeteria starting Monday. Tickets will be $7, which includes food and drinks, including a huge dessert bar and a chocolate fountain. This dance is for everyone. You can come as a couple or with a group of friends. Chocolates and flowers will be available for purchase, so bring some extra cash to purchase something for your friend or Valentine. Attire is just in fest with our Valentine's Day theme. Please wear red, pink, white, or black. See Ms. Vaughn or Ms. Afner if you have any questions. Attention all students. Today we'll have an academic shout out coming from Ms. Neff in the math hall. She is proud to share the following students earned an A on their last geometry test. They are Ashley Brandison, Anya Moore, Lorraine Rivera, and Eugene McLaughlin. Keep up the good work. Now it's weather time. Let's go to our meteorologist. I'm Carlos Coleman with today's forecast. Today we'll have a high of 34 and a low for and winds coming from the west at 15 miles per hour. Now let's take a look at the five day forecast. Tomorrow we'll have partly cloudy skies with a high of 16 and a low of three. Wednesday we'll have a mostly sunny day with a high of 17 and a low of three. On Thursday we'll have partly cloudy day with a high of 25 and a low of 15. On Friday, we'll have partly cloudy skies with a high of 31 and a low of 18. We'll wrap up our five day forecast with Saturday. We'll have par partly cloudy day with a high of 36 and a low of 26. Now please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I'm Carlos Coleman with your 411. It's that time again for another For Real Moment brought to you by Miss Afflicts Community Spotlight Class. For real? Without the discovery of this subject, mankind would not even be close to being as advanced as it is today. Any guesses on what it is? Math. Now, mathematics was not an invention. It helped develop inventions such as airplanes, the GPS, and the internet. But math was a discovery. It was always there, it just wasn't realized yet. Some people that are famous for their discoveries in the world of math are individuals such as Pythagoras, who was responsible for the Pythagorean theorem, and Isaac Newton, who was responsible for many accomplishments, such as his laws of motion and his explanation on the universal laws of gravity. Because math has helped us make all of these discoveries in the world, it allowed us to develop most of the things or concepts we have today, whether it be technology, science, or even the most trivial task, like paying bills. For instance, driving requires math when you make turns or accelerate. Every step you take or even any sport you play, there is math that goes along with it. When you throw a basketball, the angle at which you throw it and even the path the ball takes can be explained through the use of projectile motion. Math is the truth. It's all around us and understanding it can help us get a better grasp on the world we live in. This has been your For Real Moment. For Real? I'm Yashua Aqua. And I'm Quentin Dutay. You stay classy. Linda Wall. Thank you for watching today's telecast of The Morning.